Good afternoon, campers. Evening. It's um, <coughs> 12 minutes past 7. Really sleepy. Went to the weather today. Brilliant wedding. In the church. Makes a change at my age. So I usually go to more funerals than I do weddings. But I think that's the second wedding in three weeks, three or four weeks or that. So um, we went there in the church. It was absolutely beautiful. I've done a video of it and parts of it, but I don't know if he wants me to make that public or not, so I'll wait to let him see it and see what he thinks. But it's a hell of a thing. Loads of people, they're all dressed up and beautiful it was. It was really, really good. He got out in some old car. He got to take him up to the reception. Um, I felt a bit weird this morning. I don't know. I don't know if it was all that food I had last night. Or what it is, but I'm like, I'm sweating like a fucking rapist now, and my bloody legs are cold. And I feel really, really was. I mean, went up to the reception, and then I couldn't fucking face going in there. All them people, I just didn't, didn't fancy it at all. I didn't feel too good, so I and the cheetah must be a babe. Went back home, the little sofa for a couple of hours, went to sleep. And woke up and felt sort of half right, like, and she asked me if I was going to stay last night, and I went, well, I didn't want, I didn't want to drive over to the airway park on a Friday night, but I wanted a beer, because I want to keep the old thing going for every Saturday morning I do out the window, and this would be the 30th one on the row, and was it the 30th one or the 30th, I don't know, anyway, 20-something, 30-something, whatever, and, um, so I drove out here. I feel about an hour and a bit or so, napping, just fucking napped in the seat here. I just woke up and I feel like, feel like bloody shit as it goes. Um, I don't know what it is, something makes me feel not well. And I got a bit sort of worried about going and having a few drinks tonight. It made myself worse, because I can't, I can't drink and eat like I used to. Although I do my best. I don't know why I don't drink much. So, um, I'm back out here at, um, what do you call it? I don't know if you can see. I'm not getting up because I can't be fucking bothered. But there's, out the window, that's, uh, that's me field. That's where I fucking used to grow me fucks in there. But that is barren. The field I grow my fucks in, that is barren. And, um, yeah, so that's about it, really. Not much to say. I feel tired. I'm not ill, I don't think. Just off colour. But I couldn't... Well, I'm a bit sort of down and out. I mean, I don't sort of do people. don't like people much. I don't like fucking people much anyway. But, um, got me brothers now, you know. I fucking love, love them dearly, all them lot. And, uh, yeah. And, See, just, I say the last fuck I give is just went. But that's not true because uh, the fuck I give are actually negligible because there are some people I do care about. So that's it, really. I'm sort of sat here, nothing to say, nothing to do. Telly appears to work. I'm fucking sweating. It's 22.4 and I've got no heating on. Um, yeah, I told you I bought myself a multimeter and I have a go again, this fucking radio network, and went back to the number plate while working, trace that and sort that out, um, and then, I mean, I'll get back over tomorrow, I'll take it apart tomorrow and see what I can do, I'll Peter will be over Sunday, and maybe he'll have some ideas with the present. It's just legged it down there, honey, where's he going? I think he's liked it. Yeah, you got all sorts up here. Um, I haven't heard the peacock today. So whether he's still a better or not, I don't know. Oh, excuse me. So um, I've got much to say, so I should just shut up. And um, if you lot get to see it, I hope you have a really good time at the reception. Because it was a blinding wedding. 
And um, yes, yeah, so that's all I say, really. I mean, saved under a quid. I bet somebody under a quid that he'd he, he shave his beard off. And uh, he went, no, nah, he won't. I said, yeah. I won that, so he shaved his beard off. And I mean, the suits they wore. I mean, these had these suits, all these colours, these like blue, blue like, you know, like brown tan, like little bits on the pockets, that fucking smartest fuck it was. They looked really good. You know, Skinner's the best man. As I was coming out there, thing, I said, you all right? He went, yeah. I said, don't look all right. We lost your best mate, aren't we? <laughs> you know, we're, we're frightened he's not going to be allowed out anymore. <laughs> I don't expect that. I expect he'll be all right. Anyway, I'll speak to you all later. Remember, stay classy. Love you all. Bye-bye. And you, Skins. Oh, there it is.